I'll show you how to sun dry tomatoes. I find it's pretty convenient just to process them right in the garden. I'll clean them off in the rainwater. You'll need a knife, cutting board, and some pans. Cut the tomato in half, quarter it, cut them in half again. Some people leave the seeds in, some people take them out. They'll dry a lot faster if you remove the seeds. Skins down, put them in a the pan, pack them in tight. Pick only the ripe ones. Roma dry really well, but all of them will work. Even the cherry tomatoes. Make sure everything's clean. Processing out in the garden keeps the kitchen a lot cleaner. You want to make sure that you discard or cut out any of the bad spots on cut the Cut until there's nothing but clean tomato. When you get to the drying stage, there's one technique that you can use in the daytime and one at They've night. They've got to dry 24-7 or they'll get moldy. Sometimes I'll throw a little dill or some basil in there with the tomatoes. Just take out the big stem. It'll add a little flavor as it dries. When you remove the seeds, you can see how much liquid you get out. I've tried a lot of different methods of drying them, and this works the best. Heat builds up in a car, and there's no bugs in At there. At night, we have a different method. If you can park the car in the sun, even better. The sun is starting to go down, so we'll go ahead and get it onto the fan. We'll make a wind tunnel with this fan and this tablecloth. With the fan on, drag this over and just stick it to the back with the wind. You'll be surprised how well this works. It forces the air on it all through the night. The fan's been running overnight. I changed the configuration a little bit, and you can see there's a lot of moisture pulled out of there. see gaps in there to where there weren't gaps in there when we put them in last night. Now that the car's warm, we'll go ahead and put them in. As long as there's heat in the car, we'll keep them in here. Here's what they look like with a full day in the sun. We'll put them in the, the wind fan top. running all night. There's a lot more moisture out of these. The heat actually got a bit too hot in the car, so they turned black. Here's the ones from last year. You can see not quite as much black in there. Add some olive oil Add to some it. Of these to a piece of toast with hummus on it. Give it a try. So good.